Hello, this is Jane Talbot and it is day five of my out of body experience adventure. I am fresh from the astral sofa and today's program was all about learning to do the energy vortex technique. This is a technique to help create the feeling of movement in our body because it's this feeling of movement that creates a portal, a doorway into the out of body experience. As we have this sensation of rapid movement, that is the point at which we can set our intention to leave our body and to go to an identified target. So we were invited to imagine ourselves by a lake which had incredible energy. We went into the lake and then we experienced a sensation of floating. We were invited to let our fears and our blocks drain away into the healing waters of the lake. And I have to say, during this experience, I did feel a lot lighter. And in the background, the uh, sound of the sea, waves, gentle waves was playing and it really did help create I was going to say the illusion, but it did feel quite real of floating in water, a kind of ebb and a flow. And then we were invited to notice how this lake then was beginning to turn in a vortex with the centre of the vortex in our own solar plexus and allowing the vortex to spin faster and faster. And I have to say, yes, I did, by the end of it, I was left with that sense of kind of going down a plug hole and my body kind of opening up like a big, I had the image of a lotus flower opening up and then disintegrating, melding isn't the right word, but merging with the vortex itself, a sense of losing the physical body and just a sense of spinning. And then the exercise stopped. So I didn't have the same experience as I had the last two days. There were a lot of barking dogs. <laughs> Maybe it was because of that. I think for me, what has happened is the last couple of days has been sufficient to form up my unconscious mind to know what it's supposed to do. So as soon as I was invited into the lake and as soon as I know that this was going to be a swirling vortex exercise my body already started to move and it was going like this before I was actually standing in the lake <laughs> so the guy saying and now walk into the lake and I was all already in the lake and I was always already swirling in this vortex so I've learned something about the way my own mind works and the experience of movement I had today was absolutely nothing like, nothing as powerful as the experiences I had yesterday and the day before in terms of the amount of energy in my body. So I am keeping an open mind and the reason I'm keeping an open mind is because of the invitation that was offered yesterday to meet my higher conscious mind, my higher self. Now I don't really know what that is and in this spirit of adventure I am open to exploration. The door is still open for me. See you tomorrow.